All right, this is uh, some of my Eagle Tree gear. Actually, it's a full setup that you put in an airplane. I'm just going to go through each part. Um, this is the OSD Pro. Um, it's one of the main parts. You've got uh, on this side. Uh, you've got your your video um, auxiliary channel, auxiliary to throttle out elevator out and aileron out. Um, on the other side you've got your aileron in, elevator in, throttle in, auxiliary in, uh, audio in and video in. So basically all your um, receiver connections and your video connections plug into that on that end. On the other end your um, Actually, we'll just skip here. Uh, you can plug your data logger. This is a data logger V4. Um, now it plugs into your OSD Pro uh, right on this end. And now this is uh, you plug your battery into. This particular one comes with the Dean's end plugs. Um, you can buy them. I believe with just regular wires and you can solder your own plugs on but uh, I can use Dean's that's fine with me for this so this uh, this gives you your amps and your power consumption and all that kind of reading through here so you run your power through uh, your battery and to your ESC uh, in between your battery and your ESC and on the other end you've got a USB mini USB plug right here so you can um, use a mini a, a USB cord and plug it into your computer uh, for uploading and checking the data log in here which uh, logs every function that this thing has um, altitude and you know everything that the GPS gives it so then from there, uh, in one of these, I think there's three, three plug-ins there. Um, one of them plugs into, this is a, a GPS, Eagle Tree GPS version 4. So that just plugs into your data logger. And this... USB cable doesn't have to be plugged in there all the time. I just have it plugged in for uh, for programming. Actually, on my Skywalker, I leave it plugged in, and then this is just coiled up in the nose. So if I want to just uh, uncoil it and plug it straight into my computer, the wire's always there. But it doesn't have to be there. It it comes with the data logger, but uh, uh, on the wing that I'm going to be building, I won't have this in because it's it just won't make sense. Now this is the this little device here is the Guardian stabilization. I'll try to turn it so you can see what it looks like here. It's really small. And before this came out, I was actually using the uh, FY20A. Uh, but when this Guardian stabilization came out, uh, I think it was last year something like that I picked up picked it up right away and it's basically like you said it's it's small so maybe just a little bit bigger than a postage stamp the only complaint that I kind of have is this rigid wire like the wire isn't very it's flexible but it's not soft and this has to mount to a flat surface inside your airplane with that airplane icon pointing forward so you velcro this say to the bottom of the airplane and this wire is quite stiff it, I think it, it just would have made a lot more sense to have a soft wire in here but again there's maybe a reason for it I don't know so these are the basic components uh, of, of the Eagle Tree uh, FPV setup um, again this this is the stuff that goes in your airplane. You can also have uh, altitude, um, a separate, separate and together with the GPS 
Uh, you can have uh, separate airspeed with the pitot tubes. Uh, you don't have to run GPS. I think for the return to home uh, to work properly, uh, you would have to have it in place. But yeah, it's not as complicated as it seems. It's basically for a basic FPV system that'll work, you know, every time. Like mine, mine uh, gives me no problems at all. I don't even worry about it at all anymore. So it's just basically these four components. Um, there, there is a bit of programming involved um, uh, and tweaking and stuff. It's not exactly plug and play, but it's it's close. But uh, yeah, I've got this in my Skywalker, and I'm pretty happy with it. So I just thought before I installed it in the Skywalker, I kind of just give you the lowdown of what the components look like and how they plug into each other. All right. Uh, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, and uh, if you have any comments or suggestions, uh, let me know. Okay, thanks. Bye.